If you are looking for a unique and creative daytime activity to do in Charleston, South Carolina, today is your lucky day because I've got like 30 something ideas and I'm about to list them off right now. Yes, I am reading from a list, deal with it. First and foremost, Diva Dance Class, Diva Dance Party, check it out, it's awesome. You could go on a bicycle ride or a bicycle tour of downtown Charleston. You could do a walking history or pub tour or ghost tour, or you can learn about Charleston's scandalous past. There's so many things you can learn in a tour form. There's carriage rides too, those are all right, but definitely learn some history, drink some drinks and walk around town. You could charter a boat, definitely do that. Sailboats, yachts, motorboats, party boats, John boats, fishing boats, all the things we've got them. You should definitely look into that. One of my favorite things to do in Charleston. Let's see here. What else we got? Um, check out the Airbnb experiences. They have a long list of experiences that are offered by locals. One of the most popular ones is to go crabbing with what's her name. Eh, okay. I don't know, but She's really famous. <laughs> um, but yeah, lots of great experiences. I do bike tours downtown and support locals. Check out the experiences. Um, Shim Creek. Shim Creek is a really sweet spot. It's in Mount Pleasant. It's this cute little creek with all these restaurants and bars lined up along it, as well as kayaks and paddle boards and all these little adventures that you can hop on right from there. So check out Shim Creek, sunsets, drinks, happy hour brunch yes sir um next uh go hydroboarding hydro i don't know hydrofly charleston i think is the name <laughs> i'll link to all these things below or on my website bakermanning.com but it's a lot of fun check it out um you could do a walking tour or a biking tour <laughs> i already said that um let's see a cooking class we have a lot of delicious soul food, Southern cuisine, learn how to make it. Um, I think you can have them even come to you or you could go to them. <laughs> um, let's see, next, a cocktail class. Hmm. Why not? And you could do a scavenger hunt. I have a couple scavenger hunts on my website. I also have some photo challenges. Um, check them out, they're a lot of fun. You could obviously visit the historic landmarks. They're everywhere. You actually, it'd be really hard not to, <laughs> but that is something you can do. But there's some more creative ones in lieu of this list, like the angel tree, angel, angel oak tree. <laughs> it's really cool. There are some really sweet plantations on the outside, you know, of downtown and there's, you know, just lots of history <laughs> um let's see where are we at on this little list here the aquarium we have a pretty sweet aquarium great for rainy days and uh, children who love you know fish and whatnot and just adults too go to the aquarium um party bus rent a party bus that's always fun um you can either go on one of the tours that they've created or you can make your own um craft of travel is a great company for that um, next on the list, you could do the salt water cycle. Um, that's a sweet little boat where you pedal yourself around <laughs> with your group. And then, uh, oh, you could just hug or climb trees. There's a lot of really cool old trees in Charleston and I think that they're totally worth hugging, climbing, strap some hammocks and just hang out with them. They're beautiful. They've seen a lot of things. They're just, you know, wise or whatever. Um, next, hang out. That must be the hammock part of the climbing trees. <laughs> um, you could go on a little spa -a day, do spa activities. You could get pedicures, manicures, all with your friends. You could get massages, just get super bougie, fancy, and rubbed on and indulge in all the finer things in life. Um, you could also um, go to the blow dry bar and I'll get blowouts which obviously I have not done. Um, have someone do your makeup, get all glammed up and hit the town. Uh, some other fun things. Golf. We have lots of golf courses around here. Um, definitely gotta check out, make sure that they are not the private ones, but they're still cool. And if you don't like golfing ladies, you could do bar golf. <laughs> check out my website, wakeandmake.com for that. 
Um, so next on my list is you could take an art class or a candle making workshop, or there's lots of like crafty artsy classes and workshops that you can do. Um, you could also go boat camping. That is a fun one only in the fall or winter, it's way too hot in the summertime, but there is a sweet spot. I don't know if I can tell you the name of it, but you can boat there and you can camp there and it's beautiful and it's awesome and it's fun and it's creative and it's unique. For my best Charleston travel content, check out my website, bakermanning.com. I write lots of guides and resources for groups traveling to Charleston who like adventure and partying. So check it out and holla at your girl. Hmm.